Hey guys and gals, what's crack a lack and spicy here? Welcome to my channel, welcome to another video. In today's video, we are going to do a little snake wrangling. Uh, my sister-in-law called and said, Oh, there's a big old chicken snake in the uh in the duck pen. And y'all, it is it is that time. Uh, snakes are coming out, it is getting hot, and I've got to start taking care of all these chicken snakes. We got chickens we got ducks I'm going to get some more baby ducks I mean not baby ducks baby chickens and I can't have all these chicken snakes running around here and we got neighbors with chickens and ducks and quail uh, neighbor down the road's got my quail she's been taken care of I can't have these chicken snakes around here so I am going to have to dispatch this thing whenever I catch it well, we're finna go see what it looks like. Alright, so here's the ducks, the little duck pen that they got. And if you look back there in that back corner, there is a little chicken snake. Don't know yet if it's chicken snake or king snake, so I'm finna go back there and wrangle it. And then we'll tell if it's a king snake, no, it's not gonna die. But if a chicken snake, it's got to go. So let me let me let me get this thing. Here we go. This is just your regular old chicken snake. Uh, but this thing has got a pretty good distance on it. <clears throat> I've said, <clears throat> I've made videos before catching these chicken snakes because I have chickens, I've had quail. We got these ducks and these things, uh, they're around here. Um, I know because living out here in the country what a chicken snake is, rat snake, whatever you want to call them, this is what it, what it is. Um, but I've had a video before kind of telling y'all how to tell if it's venomous or non-venomous. Uh, you know, looking at their eyes, uh, on the end of their tail, there's a little split on their scales at the end of their tail. That'll tell you if it's venomous or non-venomous. Uh, and then you can look in the mouth to see if it's venomous or non-venomous. And But I know from experience that this is a non-venomous snake. But needless to say, this is going to have to be a non-existing snake. Can't have this running around eating my eggs, eating my chickens, eating my baby chicks, whatever we're going to have around here. We got neighbors down the road that's got these. But, uh, I mean, no need in being scared of something like this just with me catching it i didn't want it to bite me because they do carry bacteria in their mouth and with me getting bit right now because of everything going around i can't go to the hospital and get a shot and stuff like that i mean just being safe so got taken care of and now i need to dispatch it and get on about my business but just be aware that because it's getting hot you're going to start getting some snakes coming around just uh if you don't know your snakes don't just go up and try to you know get it with your hand just make sure that you know what you're doing if you don't call somebody that does know what they're doing so all right little snakey guys to go guys and gals this is a little quick video uh i have several people uh throughout the time call me hey i need you to come and take care of the snake so i wanted to bring y'all along on this catch and removal 
uh, of this little rat snake, chicken snake, little dude right here. Alright guys, thank y'all so much for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Hope to see you in the next one. Until then, remember, everybody has a little backwoods in them. I'll catch you later.